All right, hello, 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 and welcome back to Apollo Tires. All about sports with Manchester United, and yes, we are all about. It's a, it's a quiz that's all about sports, and we are all about Manchester United. We have Manchester United fans from across India, uh, from official supporters clubs, and various super fans as well. Uh, we are already done with round one, which was really, really close, and we've had uh, Nishargo and Nikunj qualify for the semi-finals, and I'm very excited to see what happens in this round. Uh, we have uh, Akshat Joshi from Jaipur. We have uh, Jumben from Nagaland. We have Sheriff from Shillong, and we have uh, Anirudh from uh, Nagpur. So uh, I'll just take you guys uh, through the basic rules of uh, of the quiz. Um, there's going to be five rounds. Uh, in each round, we will be asking all of you one question. Uh, there is no passing if you get a wrong answer. So feel free. Don't worry mm-hmm. that if you get it wrong, somebody else will get it right. The question is just for you. Um, if you get a correct answer, it's plus 10. Uh, there is no negative marking unless uh, you answer for somebody else, in which case you will get a minus five. Um, you get 30 seconds to answer the question. Um, and if you don't answer the question, well, it doesn't pass and uh, we will, uh, I'll, I'll just tell you what it is. Um, and in case uh, the top, I mean, the top two uh, scorers go into the next round. And if there is a tiebreaker, uh, if any of you all are tied, we'll do a little tiebreaker and decide, uh, uh, you know, it's for second place. If there's a tie for second place, uh, we'll, we'll do a little tiebreaker round for that. Cool. So um, the first round is a numbers game. Um, it's a very straightforward game where I'm going to tell you a jersey number and you have to name three players who have won that jersey for Manchester United uh, after 1992. So since the Premier League era. So I'm going to start with uh, Akshat. You ready, Akshat? Yeah. Okay, brilliant. So can you give me three players who have worn jersey number 15 at Manchester United? Andres Pereira. That's correct. Yanuzai. That is correct. And... uh... Vidic, I think Vidic. Yes, all three correct. Perfect. That is 10 points for Akshat. Well done. I'm going to move on to Chumben next. You can unmute your microphone and uh, you can tell me three players uh, who have won the jersey number 18 for Manchester United. All scores. Yeah. Ashley Young. Yeah. And Bruno Fernandes. Perfect. Brilliant. All three done. Well done. That is three. uh, That is 10 points for Chumben as well. Great stuff. We're off to a very good start. Uh, Sheriff, you're up next. If you can unmute your mic. And if you can tell me three players who have worn jersey number 13 at Manchester United. Sorry, sorry. Oh, that's fine. You don't have to say sorry. Don't worry about it. Um, but there's actually uh, a few very popular players who've worn it. Uh, you know, Park Ji Sung. <coughs> was the most popular one. We had uh, Phil Neville, Gary Neville, both of them have worn it. Uh, Ryan Giggs once upon a time wore it. We've had uh, Anders Lindegaard, Lee Grant, who's currently in the squad. But no problem. Uh, Sheriff, plenty of time to make up for it. There's five rounds, so don't worry about it. Um, Anirudh, I'm going to ask you your question next. Um, Again, uh, very straightforward. Three players who have worn number 16 at Manchester United. Okay, so uh, one of them is Roy Keane. Yep, correct. Uh, apart from that, I really can't remember any. Really? Okay, fine. We'll pass that. But there was a very obvious one, which was Michael Carrick, number 16. And the, in the current squad, well, not the current squad, but up to last year, there was Marcos Rojo also who had uh, 16. And very interestingly, Paul Scholes is there in every of these answers. I think if you're ever not sure, you should just say Paul Scholes because Paul Scholes seems to have won every number possible. Uh, for Manchester United. Okay, that's the first round uh, done. Uh, and uh, right now, if we can get the scores up, I think we have Chumben at 10, we have Akshat at 10, and Sheriff and Adirudh yet to get off the mark. But don't worry, plenty of time. Um, next up, uh, we have a round which is uh, guess the nationality. Fairly straightforward. Uh, I will give you the names of three players, and you have to tell me all three's nationalities. The same rule applies that. Uh, uh, you have to get all three for it to count. Yeah. Okay. Akshat, your question again. You have 30 seconds. Uh, yeah. Lee Grant, uh, Peter Schmeichel, and Nani. Uh, Lee Grant is English. Peter yeah. Schmeichel is uh, Danish, Denmark. Yeah. And yeah. the third one was Nani, Portugal. Perfect. All three, right? Well done. That is 20 points there for Akshat. Uh, Chumben, I'm going to go to you next. 
if you can tell me the yes. prim- and and again this is we're not talking about the second nationality the the, the primary nationality for which they have uh, which is uh, Andreas Pereira uh, Mikael Silvestra and Daley Blind Andreas Pereira is Brazilian yes Daley Blind is Dutch and yes. Mikael Silvestra is uh, French perfect all three right well done chimban that's 20 points to you as well okay uh next up we're going to go with uh sheriff uh your your three are uh patrice evra uh, joel perera and uh, facundo pelistri patrice evra french yes joel perera brazil unfortunately incorrect but you want to answer the third one anyway pelistri is three Netherlands now incorrect so joel pereira is portuguese he's from portugal and uh, facundo pelistri is uh, same country as cavani uruguay oh. <laughs> don't worry about it that's absolutely fine okay moving on next to anirudh um your three are alex telles uh, anders lindegard and ronny jonsson okay uh, so alex telles is uh, brazilian yes uh ronny johnson is i think norwegian perfect and anders lindegard he's also norwegian i think oh no he's danish danish, danish. <laughs> unlucky yeah unlucky anirudh um, so that means we are at the end of round 2 so that's akshat on 20 uh, chumben on 20 and sherif and anirudh uh, we will i'm sure you guys will get off the mark soon all right the next round round 3 is called uh, transfer rule Uh, what i'm going to do is i'm going to tell you the list of clubs or basically the transfer history of a particular player and you have to tell me which player it is right um akshat going to start yeah. with you uh he this is a player who's gone red star belgrade spartak moscow manchester united inter milan uh vidic nemanja vidic perfect vidic is correct uh that is great that means 30 to akshat now uh chumben your question we'll go next okay. Yes. Um this is a player who's uh, got a pretty long transfer history. Uh, it's Mets, Fulham, Manchester United, Everton, Spurs, Sunderland and Lazio. So I think the key thing for you is Fulham to Manchester United and Manchester United to Luis Everton. Luis Saha. That is correct. Luis Saha is absolutely correct. Brilliant. Well done, Jimben. That is 30 points to you as well. Okay. Um Sheriff, I'm going to ask you this one. Um uh, So this is uh, Liverpool, Real Madrid, Newcastle, Manchester United, and Stoke. Sorry, I don't know. All right, the answer is Michael Owen. Michael Owen. So I think the biggest hint there was Liverpool uh, because he started his career there. It's not a problem. Um, Anirudh, I'm going to ask you your question. Um, okay, so this is Leeds United. Oldham Athletic, Manchester United, Wolves. This is Alan Smith. No, but a good guess. Alan Smith starting at Leeds United. This is actually Dennis Owen. Oh. Yeah. All right. At the end of round three, where do we stand? It is again Akshat and Jumman leading the way with thirty and thirty. Sheriff and Anirudh are uh, yet to get off the mark. Not a problem. Don't worry about it. Okay, round four is uh, fairly straightforward. It's what's common, right? I'm going to tell you two players' names, and you have to tell me. Maybe two players, maybe more. Uh, but you have to tell me what is common between the two of them. All right. So, Akshat, your yeah. question is: What is what is an accolade that both Van der Sar and Ryan Giggs hold at Manchester United? Or what is one achievement that both of them have at Manchester United? Van der Sar and, and Ryan, Ryan Giggs. Giggs. Yeah. I think uh, both players uh, played for Manchester United when they were uh, aged over 40. That is correct. Both players have played for United at the age of 40 years old. Great answer. Um okay, Chumben, I'm going to go with your question next. Yes. Um so what is common between Mark Hughes, Mark Bosnich and Paul Pogba? Mark Hughes, uh Mark Bosnich and Paul Pogba. Mark Bosnich. No, 
You can take a guess. Juventus is a big hint. Uh, they have all won Serie A. No, incorrect. The answer is that all of them have signed for another club and come back to sign for Manchester United. Oh, yes. Yeah. But, all right, not a problem. That is uh, Chumben still at uh, 30. Uh, Akshat is uh, in the lead now at 40. Um, Sheriff, your question. Um, what is common at Manchester United? All of these three guys uh, had the same thing. What is that for Romelu Lukaku, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, and Paul Scholes? All three of them have had the same what? Aggressive behavior. <laughs> if only. Not a bad answer. But if you want to give it a go, I'll give you another chance. Uh, go for it. Okay, no problem. Uh, all, all three of them have worn the jersey number nine for Manchester United. Lukaku, Zlatan and Paul Scholes. All right. We're going to move on now to Anirudh. Um, so what accolade or achievement do Andy Cole and Dimitar Berbatov have in common? Uh, they were the league's top scorer in their debut season. Mm, I mean, I'm not entirely sure that's true, but I, okay, I'll give you a hint of what I'm looking for. Um, Andy Cole did this against Ipswich and Berbatov did this against Blackburn Rovers. Oh, both of them scored five goals in a match. That is correct. Well done. Okay, we're going to give 10 points over there to Anirudh. Well done. And now we're going to move on to our final round, which is just a simple trivia round. It's going to be a direct question um, and uh, it has just a straightforward answer. And we'll see it just to test how much you know about uh, Manchester United. Okay. So, uh, Akshat, I'm going to ask you your question. Um, when Andy Cole signed for Manchester United in 1995, what was the squad number given to him? I'm guessing it's a trick question. Can't be. It's obviously not number nine. It's it's obviously not number nine. I'm between twenty five and seventeen. Uh, Take seventeen. Seventeen. That is absolutely correct. Well done, number seventeen. Great answer, Akshat. Superb. Excellent answer. All right. Uh, okay, Chumban, I'm going to go to you next. Your question yes. is: uh, How many goals did Sir Bobby Charlton score for England? For England, uh, for United, he scored 249. But for England... So I'll give you a, a hint if you want it. Uh, two of those numbers you have already mentioned right now. Uh, 49 then? <laughs> that is correct. 49. Well done. Okay, okay. 49 goals for England. Uh, that means Chumban is in second place still. Uh, Sheriff, I'm going to ask you your question. Okay, uh, Wayne Rooney scored his last goal for Manchester United against which club? Everton. Everton is a good guess. Unfortunately, it was against Tottenham Hotspur. If I'm not wrong, I could be wrong. It was a free kick. Uh, but uh, yeah, that was the last goal that Wayne Rooney scored. And uh, Anirudh, this is actually a very fun question. Um, so shortly after his departure from Manchester United, Eric Cantona became the captain of which French national team? Uh, I think he became the captain of the beach football team. That is correct. Him. Absolutely correct. The French national beach football team. That's a great answer. Well done. We can uh, please get the final scores on right now. So Akshat uh, absolutely blitzing through this quiz with 50 points. Uh, finishes in first place. Uh, Chumben in second place with 40. Sheriff unfortunately couldn't get off the mark, but no worries at all. Thank you so much for participating. And Anirudh Moralka getting 20, trying to mount a second half comeback like Manchester United usually do, but uh, not quite making it. But thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much for taking part. And congrats to, to Akshat and Chumben. We will see you guys in the semi finals. Thank so you much. to everybody for tuning in uh, to, to All About Sports. And uh, we'll see you in the next qualifier round. We've got one more qualifier to go. And if you're enjoying these videos, please hit the like button, uh, hit share and subscribe to the channel. All right. Take care. Bye.